Hello everyone, let us talk about investment in Istanbul, Turkey through the real estate or property. We will divide the investment into two categories. The first one is short term investment and the second one long term investment. For the short one, it could be the property managing by a company and that is like it's called Airbnb system. That will be ranging between, let us say, 6 to 7 percent as a net income. This is annual rental income for your property. But that will be only in the very central districts, like which is so crowded with the people, with the foreigners, because the Airbnb system only it will be working in the, uh, I mean, the foreigner districts like Taksim. I mean like Aksaray, like the very very crowded districts. Long term investment, it is with a rental contract between you and between the tenant and it is renewable every year if you and the tenant you want to continue for the next years. So the question is, what is the percentage of the long term investment for the residential units? It is almost 4% unfortunately. So how can I get the benefits of the property and the investment, the high rental income uh, in Istanbul, Turkey with this long term investment. You cannot get long uh, during the long term investment, I mean the high rental income. Why? Because Istanbul, the main player, the main buyer here, they are Turks. I mean, we cannot compare it with, uh, let us say, with uh, Dubai or other countries. At the end of the day, if you go for short term investment or long term investment, there is something for your benefit as a, the owner of the property. Every year in Turkey, we have increasing in prices in terms of everything, whatever you want. So as the owner of the property, you have the right to increase the percentage of the rent. You're going to tell the tenant that, for example, it was 4000 Turkish Lira. I mean, for one bedroom, let us say now it has been increased. It depends on the municipality decision. It is, for example, for for four thousand now and four hundred, and that's your right. And uh, this is the system in Turkey. It's working just like this. The owners usually increase the rent every year, uh, depending on the municipality decisions. Thank you so much, my friends, for watching. See you in the next episode.